Lucid dreaming occurs when someone who is dreaming becomes aware they are dreaming. In some cases, people report being able to make decisions and manipulate the content of their dreams during a lucid dreaming episode. While there has historically been some skepticism about lucid dreaming, researchers have confirmed the occurrence of lucid dreaming through various methods. For example, one approach involves instructing individuals to make specific eye movements upon entering a lucid dreaming state. Using this method, scientists have observed lucid dreamers making the specific eye movements as instructed, even though their brain activity indicated they were asleep. These types of methods have helped to verify lucid dreaming as a real sleep phenomenon. Neuroscientists, however, are still investigating what happens in the brain to allow lucid dreams to occur. Most episodes of lucid dreaming happen during rapid eye movement, or REM, sleep. Some evidence suggests that lucid dreams can occur when the brain becomes highly activated during REM sleep, leading to threshold levels of awareness, even though overall brain activity remains within levels that are consistent with sleep. Although the research is preliminary, neuroimaging evidence suggests areas of the brain that are highly active during metacognition, or the awareness of one's own thinking, might also be more active during lucid dreaming. Researchers are exploring ways to induce lucid dreams in order to make them easier to study, and one method that has shown some promise is the use of drugs that increase levels of the neurotransmitter acetylcholine, specifically a type of drug called an acetylcholinesterase inhibitor. The mechanism by which these drugs might facilitate lucid dreaming is still unclear, but researchers hope to uncover it with further studies.